This is just an intro. Intro, intro. Do ball shoot my shot like a pistol. Dribble game official. Yeah, yeah. Got all the ops straight jumping out the window. Call the mechanic, I break your bus. Nine nine strength boy, I take your lunch. If you a sub, then you one of us. Broke boy, leave you crushed. Bow. What's going on YouTube? It is your boy One Star Week for the you and I watching another episode of the Broke Boy Road to Glory, and we are on a mission. We are on a quest today. To get a foot birthday card on this episode right here, right now. We're going to open our foot chance rewards, our division rivals rewards. And we're going to do some SBCs and hopefully we hit it big. Um, because there are some very interesting cards in packs at the moment. So, without further ado, we're going to get into these foot chance rewards. Unfortunately, I couldn't be bothered to play Passover 1. And this is the second straight week this has happened. Um, yeah, the gameplay was just so bad. I wasn't really having fun. I was also short on time because it was a very busy weekend. So we finished on like, I believe 12 and five. And it just tells you a lot that I had a record where I'm winning like two out of every three games and I'm still not having a good time. It just, I don't know. The gameplay was on another level <laughs> as far as how bad it was last week. But I'm gonna stop talking about it. Let's get into these rewards. We have red player picks and the team of the week doesn't really particularly excite me. Um, so hopefully we get a high rate of play here. That's really what I'm hoping for. All right, 84, Mario Fernandez. Every year at the beginning of FIFA, I like using this guy's right back card um, because I find it to be overpowered. This card's definitely behind <laughs> the power curve and there is no good strong link for him. So we will take that as SBC father and we move. Let's open these packs. I believe the packs actually aren't bad considering the lack of effort that it takes to get them. We're gonna start off with these jumbo premium gold players. Seven rare, seven chances at an icon moment. Seven chances at a foot birthday Sane maybe? I don't know, what are we saying? Not even the board, okay. It's hard for me to be mad because I don't really expect anything. I don't really deserve anything I think, but we do get some UCL cards, that's pretty cool. This is like one of the only times this year I packed Felipe Anderson for whatever reason, even though he's a Brazilian winger at Porto, he's very rare. Uh, for a card like him. So, mega pack it is. I guess I'm gonna have to sell for icon moments in this pack instead. <laughs> what are we saying? All right, um, we do get an inform here, so that's kind of spicy. It's Dutch, it's a left mid, and it's gonna be, oh, it's not even Dutch. Ooh, it's this guy. Gerson Rodriguez. He has like 96 pace, he's like 6'4", but he can't really do much else. But he is an inform, so I will take that. That's not really bad. Oh, 6'3". I'm bugging. He has a two-star weak foot. He can't really shoot. Can't really pass. Can't really... Oh, my. 43 agility and 42 mounted. He's a left mid. Jesus. But he's a very... <laughs> he's a very unique card in that sense, man. Like, he has mad pace. Mad physical. Nothing else. He's just an absolute athlete. Um, so, yeah, those are going to be our foot champs rewards. Can't really say I deserve much better than that, to be honest. Um, we only played till server one. But we got Division Rivals rewards, and unfortunately, we only got rank three Division two. Um, <laughs> I've learned that when I only played to Silver one, it's hard for me to even get to rank two or rank one in Division one. Um, I just, I never have the time for whatever reason throughout the week. I think it's because I'm doing reviews on my other account. But here we are, rare Mega Pack times two, Mega Pack times two. Um, not too bad here. We could get something decent. And if we, if we don't, hopefully we get some SBC fodder. I want at least one walkout out of these. Mega pack number two it is. We're going to start with that. I'm safe on my pre-workout because I'm going to get my workout in after this video. Um, yeah, <laughs> that, that, that's nothing. Absolutely nothing. Trash. Get it off my screen. We have another mega pack to open. And so far, it's been a very boring episode. I'm not going to lie to you. Another non-board, wow. Just like my luck was on last week, my luck seems to be completely turned off this week. Um, I don't know what EA's done to it. I don't know if I've misplaced my luck. Yeah, the only decent cards in this pack were, were untradeables that I already had. So, we got two rare mega packs though. Two chances at greatness, two chances at glory. Can we at least get an 85 out of these? All right, this is um, a step in the right direction here. Um, Tiddy. I think I already have him though. 
I hope I don't. I hope I threw him in the SBC already. I hope I threw him in the SBC already. All right, 83 on Titty. We also get 83 cast steals, but we already have them. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, man. All right, final rare mega pack. EA, what are you doing to me? What are you doing? What is this? Oh my god, not even a board. That is disgusting. Hey, we got Hamas. Can I get mad? Can I really get mad when we packed Hamas? I don't know. I can't call it. We get a mixed contracts pack. The best pull of the episode so far. And now we are making sure that we're signing our players to contract extensions. Let me look at these SBCs real quick. I know there's a party bag SBC that did drop today. If I could just find it. We also got this daily challenge, which I'm definitely gonna do. And we also got a marquee matchups. Real quick, I wanna see what you can get in this party bag. Does it tell you? You can get a rule breakers, a road to the finals, a record breaker, a team of the group stages, foot freeze, Headliners, future stars, what if, or foot birthday player. Jeez, you could essentially get any promo card in this game. I was thinking about saving this till tomorrow because then there's gonna be more foot birthday players in packs. But with how many cards there are in this, like I don't even know if that even is gonna make a big difference. So we're gonna do that at the end of the episode. Uh, I'm gonna do the daily challenge. I'm gonna do the marquee matchups, and I'll see you soon. All right, guys, back like I've never left and we have done the marquee matchups we have done the daily challenge and I'm thinking after this we're gonna do some 81 um, upgrades and after that we're gonna do the final kahuna uh, <laughs> the party bag I don't know why uh, it took me so long to think about the, uh, about the name of that I think I need some more caffeine <laughs> but it's what it is uh, here we go we got seven packs to open so lots of fun here to be had we're going to start off with the 75 rated rare player. Let me know in the comment section down below, what is the best player you have gotten from the 75 plus rare gold player? I think I've gotten some crazy pulls from this. I'm pretty sure I've gotten the Jordi Alba, maybe even the Conte. I've, I've gotten some crazy things from that pack, which is nuts. We get an Urzel here, so nothing crazy. If it was a foot birthday Urzel, I mean, sign me up, but it's not. Um... <laughs> What else we got here? We got Jumbo Gold Pack. You know what? We're going to go for the two rare gold players pack. Um, the luck here has been bad, all right? So I'm not really expecting that much. We do get a board, which is not bad from a, a two rare gold players pack. And we are we are going to get PZ, right? That's not Rafa. Rafa's a left mid. This is PZ. 84 rated. He's going to the SBC. Trust and believe. We got Jumbo Gold Pack to open. Not too exciting, but you never know. Stranger things have happened. Maybe we'll pack something big. We won't. We won't. Um, okay. Great stuff. Oh, we get a Jumbo Premium Gold Pack from that. So you know what? That's actually not too bad. For a free pack, let's get it. What are we going to get inside of it? Maybe this is EA's way of giving us something decent. I don't know. No, no, it's not. But, I mean, it's a free pack. So, if I quick sell everything in it, it's essentially, it's essentially free coins. But I will be keeping these players for SBC. So, but I'll quick sell everything else, though. I don't need any, any of this stuff right here. Right there. Free 900 coins plus the players. Thank you very much, EA. It's the most generous thing you have done for me so far today. We have a gold players pack to open. These packs are coming and they're coming quick. But the players, not so much. The players, they, they can keep, to be honest. <laughs> Nothing in there as well. Duplicate Zahavi. Duplicate Dem. The Dem guy might sell because the Napoli SBC is pretty nice. Um, premium Gold Players Pack. I don't know. I don't know what to say here. I'm not really too excited. Nothing again. Like, you can't even give me a board EA. Come on. Come on, do it. Don't do it for me. Do it for the people that's watching this video, man. I'm sure they're dying of boredom right now. They are dying of boredom. Prime Electrum Players Pack. Can you give me something? Anything? I am begging. I am on my knees. Okay, they have given us something decent. Who is this? Oh, we've gotten Mertens. You know what? That's the best pull of the episode. 85 rated Mertens. It says a lot. 
that that's the best pull of the episode but it is an 85 rated card so that's pretty cool EA more of that please is there any chance he's selling for yo 18k that's not too bad actually we get Rodak Black we get this guy that's pretty cool um oh yo we got Jude Bellingham that's pretty oh wait somebody's coin transferring right there I don't want to be a snitch but you know I'm just saying <laughs> Uh, that was a decent pack. I'm not gonna lie. That Bellingham card should sell for like 1k just because he's Jude Bellingham. So that's pretty cool. We got a 45k pack to open right now. Um, can we continue with that kind of luck, please? Okay. Yo, it's an inform. I'm telling you guys. Oh, it's the same guy again. I always do this, yo. I always pack the same guy when it comes to informs or red picks more than one time in this episode. But will I complain? Absolutely not. He's an inform. Um, I'm... I'm gonna hold them because with certain company when certain SBCs come out, uh, these informs go up by a lot, even the low rated inform. So since I don't need the coins immediately right now, I will be holding him. We're gonna do some 81 um, upgrades, I think, um, because I do want to get some fodder to do that uh, party bag SBC. Of course, when I'm done, you will be the first one to know and I will be right back. Yes, so I'm done. Um, I have done five 81 plus player picks. I could probably do a few more, but I do want to save some for tomorrow when Team 2 comes out. Just in case I could get lucky and pack one of them. Um, but here we are. Five player picks. We're going to start off with player pick number three. We're hoping for some SBC fodder at the very least. And uh, yeah, uh, should I even open the party bag if my luck is like this today? Jesus Christ. Player pick number two. Okay. <laughs> Player pick number three. Wow. Wow. We've gotten Taliska twice. I could have gotten him twice. Player pick number four. We've only gotten 183 so far. Okay. This is what I need, EA. This. Inject this into my veins. Yeah, I need more of that. Please. Final player pick. Foot birthday. Oh, it's... Oh. Whoa. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Yo, I take back everything I said. We have gotten Harry Kane and Soma to kill uh, that series off. Um, so, yeah. We're going to go ahead and do the foot birthday party bag if I can find it. Here it is. Um, I'll be right back. The moment has arrived. We have done the foot birthday party bag. And let me remind you, I am probably going to pack absolute trash in this. But that's the chance we take to, to be great on this series. I feel like when you run an RTG... You almost have no choice but to do these SBCs or else the top cards on this game are completely unattainable. So sometimes you got to take the risk. Sometimes you got to take a swing and hopefully it doesn't miss. I'm putting my controller down. My work here is done. Foot, birthday, party bag, and it would be great if we pack a foot birthday. Uh-oh. What is that flare? Oh. Oh, no. That's horrible. I know exactly who this is. I don't even got to open my eyes, man. Wow. Wow. An 84 rated squad for an 83 rated card with no links. And they got eliminated, didn't they? Like, they're not even in Europa anymore. Wow. What a bad card. I mean, to be fair, he'll be useful for the Bundesliga objectives, but... Yeah, all right. All right. <laughs> So, um, that is, that is the, that is it for the pack opening today. Um, this is the team I was rocking with last weekend. I haven't really touched it yet. I think what I'm really going to do here is bring Ronaldo back. Um, what I did here though, is that Ryan Kent right mid is coming out tomorrow as a foot birthday. And if he does, I'm going to have to buy him. All right. I'm definitely going to have to buy him because he has the perfect link to Tavernier I mean I'm absolutely gonna buy him um and hopefully he's not too expensive out of our our price range or anything like that I don't think he should be um but yeah that's gonna be my episode for today I think I'm rocking with pretty much almost the same team as I did last weekend um I'm probably gonna sell Tiago because he's our most expensive player and I'm gonna need the coins if I'm gonna buy Ryan Kent let me know in the comment section down below what did you guys pack once again don't forget to like and subscribe I will see you in the next episode but until then